Black trunks for Aaron Blakey. White trunks for Neff Hickson. Blakey immediately with the right hand. It's a nice straight right hand right down the pipe. Blakey looking to extend the jab, throws the lead left hook. There's the right to the body. You Slight can, forward pressure early on from Aaron Blakey. You can tell Blakey right now, when he comes in, he's throwing hard shots. That's his defense right there. Trying to work his way in. He's just coming with hard shots, making that. Overhand up. right in the uppercut. Dad sends Nav Hickson back. Big body shots, and down goes Nav Hickson. Here's the mandatory eight count from Chris Batchelor. And Hickson looks like, I don't think he's getting up already. Hickson says he can't see, pointing to his eye. That's the end of the fight. And that is a phenomenal Barnacle Fighting Championship debut for Aaron Blake. I'm confused, but it was, it's different. Round number one. He needed forward pressure from Paul Cook. He's in the great trucks. And down on the canvas, right back up, but dropped and taking the mandatory eight count from Alan Jackson, Aaron Foster in the black trucks. And I love the right hand of the body that was thrown by, by Cook right there. It was beautiful, it landed perfectly, and it set up a knockdown. Sporting touch of hands, you see the hands high and tight for Paul Cook to the body. Rear right uppercut, knockdown number two. Another good right hand of the body. I think it's doing a lot of damage right there. It's making Foster think about what's happening. And asking Foster if he wants to continue. He does not get the answer he's looking for. And just like that, a lightning strike win for Paul Cook in his BKFC debut. Watch it up. Round number one. Black trucks for the Englishman Morgan Starkey. Black and red trucks for the Polish fighter based in Scotland, Patrick Sagon. It's high and tight, looking to the inside. Of left hook from Sagan and that drops Starkey. And the first punch landed, did the jab, got the knock jab. Wow. Let's see if that changes the way Starkey can, comes forward the next time. Beautiful check left hook from Sagan. Big shots to the inside and knocked down number two. John, that's a theme right here, these uppercuts. People are not seeing them coming and they're doing damage. It's a guy that's landed another punch, and that did damage. I'm not sure Starkey's getting up. Starkey now cut under his left eye, taking the mandatory in from Bachelor, who waves it off, and the win, just like that, in his BKFC debut for Patrick Sagan. Round number one, blue trucks for Gary Fox, black trucks for Hayden Sheriff. Immediately to the mid-range, firing big hooks as Gary Fox now into the clinch. Right, right, right. On the turn. From Alan Jackson, right back to it. Entry on the right hand. Marks throwing heavy shots to the head, to the body. And the reset for Hayden Sheriff. Hands high and tight. There's the left hook, and down goes Hayden Sheriff. And I'm not sure if that was a body shot or a head shot. The way Sheriff's looking right now, it looks like he's hurting still. Alan Jackson just said to Hayden Sheriff, you can't see. Sheriff obviously indicated as such. Jackson breaks off his count and win number one in BKFC for Gary Fox. Round number one. Black and silver trunks for the Englishman, Morgan Starkey. So oh, black and oh, yellow trunks oh. for Morgan Stradoric, who's in big trouble as the Romanian goes down and now taking the count from Mike Belgrave. Radoic is still hurt. He got clipped a couple times and hit after he was hurt. Whoa! Mike Belgrave stops this fight, and you see the protestations of Marius Radoic. Radoic was up, was telling Belgrave he wanted to continue. Belgrave decides that Radoic has had enough, and a lightning strike win in his BKFC debut for Morgan Stark.